you make your way in plain view Every creation from every nation is standing watching you You are subdued by the angels as they pull you through To finally meet the one who created you you receive your book of deeds, indeed it's exactly what it seems A detailed account of exactly who you used to be Every moment of jealousy, envy and slander against your peers Every deed that was thrown away because it just wasn't sincere How much regret is in your heart, how ashamed are you now How many blessings did you receive, so many that you couldn't count As you turn the pages you are in a state of denial Wondering how you will ever escape from the fate of this trial Do you recognize these sins? Yes, my lord, I do Without a translator, Allah is speaking to you Over and over again with each sin you feel doomed Wishing you could go back in time and act upon what you knew But who is there to blame when change never came from you? You loved this dunya, but this dunya never loved you too So was it really worth disobeying your lord's rules? Even though he never asked of you more than what you could do Just to worship him alone with no partners or crew So no need for witnesses to confirm what you already knew But just so that you know that his justice is the truth The angels that sat next to you all these years give their views They wrote down everything that you said and it's true Your mouth will be sealed and your tongue will not need to move Because your limbs will begin to sing as to what they used to do Your thighs and eyes will tell no lies when your Lord asks them to review And what will it be like on the day the messengers submit their proof Testify against their people be a witness against you and finally the earth will come alive and cry out in reply to describe how you denied all the signs that it supplied but if you believed and worked righteous deeds you will be rewarded for your faith if even a mustard seed the scale will tell your tale and distinguish your degree show your fail with no avail or put your heart at ease وَنُفِقَ فِي الصُّورِ ذَلِكَ يَوْمُ الْوَعِيدِ وَجَاءَتْ كُلُّ نَفْسٍ مَعَهَا سَائِقٌ وَشَهِيدٌ لَقَدْ كُنْتَ فِي غَفْلَةٍ مِنْ هَذَا فَكَشَفْنَا فبصرك اليوم حديد وقال قرينه هذا ما لدي عتيد ألقيا في جهنم كل كفار عنيد من And the trumpet will be blown. That will be the day that has been promised. 
and every person will come forth, along with an angel to drive him, and an angel to bear witness. It will be said to the sinners, Indeed, you were heedless, but now we have removed your covering, and your sight is sharp this day. And his companion will say, Here is this record ready with me. And it will be said, Both of you, throw into hell every stubborn disbeliever, hinderer of good, transgressor and doubter, who set up another god with Allah, then cast him into the severe torment. His companion will say, O oh Lord, I did not push him to transgress in disbelief, oppression and evil deeds, but he himself was in error and far astray. Allah will say, Do not dispute in front of me. I had already in advance sent you the warning. The sentence that comes from me cannot be changed, and I am not unjust in the least to the slaves. On the day when we will say to hell, Are you full up? It will say, Are there any more to come? The messengers will be brought forth in the arena of judgment and will be asked about the matter which Allah entrusted them. And they will proceed to testify against their people concerning the actions they used to do. Every witness you could imagine will come forth. The angels are used to record your actions, the scholars, the earth, the sky, the night and the days, your tongues, your hands and your feet will bear witness for you or against you on that day and all the people will be brought to account standing rows upon rows in front of the Lord of all mankind. Now I want you to imagine after experiencing the terror and horror of this day which will last for 50,000 years you have finally completed your reckoning with Allah Azza wa Jal and your deeds have been placed on the scale. How do you feel right now? You are probably still very scared, exhausted and worn out. After all the stress and anxiety, you wish that you could enjoy even a brief glimpse of relaxation and perhaps a nice simple moment of refreshment. And that's when you see it. The pond from Al-Kawthar.